Hey everybody, James with My Brewer Supply. Gonna show you the latest iteration of our heated welping kit. It's changed just a little bit. It's mostly to do how the pig rail works. Um, so this is, by the way, we can build this heat system to go with any crate or contraption that you can build, buy, or make for welping your puppies. We like this one here. It's a 42 by 28. Get it from Amazon for like 60 bucks. The double door version of this is really nice. Gives you a lot better access. Got a door in the front door. Yes. I like that a lot. Um, I like this one. It's Amazon Basics. And it's, it's nice and heavy and sturdy. Yes, it's not got flimsy. Yes, it does. And it's got smaller, smaller little gray holes. So you can have a problem with puppies getting their head stuck in the cheap ones. If that happens, you can always put a strip of cardboard around the inside to stop that from happening. But if you buy this kind, you, you don't have, have worry. That That's a worry. Yeah. Though. Okay. Yeah. So. All right, Tammy, show us what we've got. We've got, first off, here is the, the, the thermostat. It's set for 104. There it is. It'll read in Fahrenheit, or you can make it read in it centigrade. Uh, I'll show you what's going on here. So, let's just turn the lights on on this. There we go. All right, so let, let me just, we've got to get right in the right spot. Oh, we've got to find it where the heat, there's the heat right there, 100, 105, 106. Look at that right here. 105, 106. Mm -hmm. What's the temperature in the middle of the cage? Room temperature or less. Mm -hmm. so and mama likes that. That's what mom loves, exactly. So what do the, the puppies do? The puppies are either nursing on mom, getting heat on mom. When they're finished nursing on mom, they get a little cool. They get a little cool, they'll start, from, they will bump into this, it just feels nicely warm. Just I, If I was a puppy, guess mm -hmm. where I'd be? Right there where it's warm. I'd either be at the milk bar or I'd be right here. Right. Show so, you. yeah. All right, so now here's our slightly different rails. You buy a 10 foot stick of one and a half inch PVC pipe. It's gonna cost you like five bucks. You get these corner adapters from us mm -hmm. and they used to look like that. Now they look like, now you get these little sponge pieces. Yeah. And the reason- because the babies used to get back behind here without that foam piece on there. And they'd get stuck because they only have one motion forward, yes. not backwards. So yes. they so get they, stuck. So now they hit here and they move off to the side. And, and they, I came up with that little invention. Tammy came up with that. Tammy came up with that. <laughs> See, things. I am smart. Yeah. I am smart. So if you've got the older system, you don't have these, just go get yourself one of these noodles. You can buy them at home supply stores. Three and a quarter inches of noodle. Cut it up, yep. stick it on there. Fixes that problem immediately. It's okay the other way, but it just stops a puppy getting stuck and screaming, yes. that's all. You won't yes. hurt the puppy. You wonder what's happened, yeah. Yeah. yes. Yeah. Okay, so um, super easy to set up, literally minutes. The heat yes. tape is applied to the bottom of this. I've shown you other videos of how to do that. Yes. Let's just pull the whole thing apart so you can see how quickly okay. it goes. If you can see how quickly I can pull it apart, you'll see how quickly this is put And together. it can go under your bed. All right, so, it this can comes, go so the, the nice thing about this now is this is so easy to put in. You have to rest it inside. So there's this. Right. And here's these And show me again the pieces that actually come to them. The pieces that come to them. So I'm just going to disassemble this. It's just the corner. That's okay. Okay. There you go. Okay. That's what comes with the, yeah, that and the foam piece. You just snap it on there. And you can slip that under your bed too. Yeah. Absolutely. Or in a closet. Somewhere nice out of the way. Can we go with that? Clean it up, of course. Okay, so then if it's super easy, of course we can unplug it. We'll just take the towel out. Uh -huh. By the way, we recommend a towel because it gives traction to the babies. Yes, you want those little legs and those hips working on the traction of the from the towel. Just flip it down. You've got all the doors locked up. We're in a well old machine. Yeah, Bingo. Put, uh, slip Bingo. it under the bed, put it in the closet. So the whole whatever. idea behind this is, babies are with mum for the first three weeks. We don't separate mum from babies. We do monitor things for the first two to three days. Yes. After that, we do very little. We have but a litter. Yeah, you actually get six and six hours of sleep instead of getting up every two hours and separating the mama from the babies like some people do. A lot of people separate mom from babies. Yes, we think yes. it's a hugely bad idea. Yes, yes, it doesn't teach mama to have her natural no. instincts that she's got to take care of them. Right, heat lamps, what do you think about heat lamps? Oh, horrible, I had oh. a guy tell me, he says, not only does it burn up mama, well it burns me when I'm trying to get in there and take care of 
what I need to clean up. I had a customer the other day tell me about their heat lamp experience. The heat lamp fell, landed on a puppy, and burned the puppy's head. That's horrible. 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 So the whole idea by this is mum so wants to be in there. So don't do a heat lamp. She's not getting heated up at all. Right. She wants to be in there. She'll, she will love being in there with the babies. Mm -hmm. Babies are either nursing on mum, or they are stop nursing and they st want to find a warm area. They start congregating around the outside under the pig rail. They mm -hmm. could not be in a safer place. Right. This makes you not the mama. It makes mama the mama. Right. And you can go to the grocery store knowing, you know, after the first three days, you're, you can feel like that maybe you can leave the house for about an hour and come back. And you know where mama is. She's right in there with her babies. She's not going to squish them because of the pig railing that's in there and they're nice and warm. Of course, now I cover it up like a bird cage for a good, they're still at three weeks so we have being covered up because of our litter, yeah. yeah. And uh, So that is right there, yeah. they're three weeks old almost. What have we done for them? What do we have to do for them? I just feed mama and water mama and let her out to potty and change the bedding and that's all we've done. And we let mom outside. When we she love has... on the babies. Yeah, when we let mom inside, what does she do? And she goes straight right back in there. There's no pushing and shoving. No. She just goes right in there. We with tell the her to pin up, and she gets right in there. She we don't right have to tell her that. Do she just foot. goes. Yeah, exactly. She knows what to do. She knows right. those are her right. babies. Look, if you're going to be the mum and you're going to take babies away, I think it's a hugely bad deal. Mm -hmm. But if you do that, we do know the name of four or five divorce mm -hmm. lawyers who can help you through the divorce <laughs> process. <laughs> When yeah, because spouse. if you don't get sleep, I'm not a happy If Tommy camper. doesn't get sleep, I'm not getting and any no sleep. And no coffee. You got <laughs> yeah, the best thing, you know, yeah. Okay. So we can build this for any size crate you can come yes. up with. It Just need be, the measurements. Yep. It can be a crate. It can be a paddling pool. It can be an easy whelp, a dural whelp, a quick Yep, whelp. but if they're measuring, they got to measure the tray, the inside well, of the tray. Well, we've got directions on that, yeah. so it's all pretty straightforward. If there's any doubt about any of this, guess what? If you call us up, you get a human being. You don't get an automated attendant. You don't get put on hold. You talk to somebody, me, Russ, Cody, somebody who knows everything about this. Right. And we can help you even if you're having something you're not sure what to do. Get right. on the phone, call us, we'll help yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. And Cody is our son. It's a family-run business. Yep. So that's the best way to have a business is a family business. A family business who has first started off by raising dogs. Oh, we've done it, what, Frenchies for 17 years? Yes. And then before that, we used to raise labs, and that was for eight so years. So this is a patented product by us, and it's because we've learned about the things not to do right. that have shown us the we've things. We've learned by mistakes, so we're right. preventing you do. from having mistakes, right. hopefully. So um, oh, www.mybreedersupply.com. And you can order pieces, you know, that you need extra pieces if you lose your car adapter you can order pieces like that off of my yes. breed and everything supply. we've ever sold we sold pieces for still yeah yeah yep. guys thanks for watching be safe bye